Hello all. Yes, in this video, we are going to discuss the position of tetrahedral voids and their effective number in a HCP unit cell. Here I have already drawn the position of tetrahedral voids. It's actually formed between four atoms of this arrangement. So if four atoms are like this, this position is tetrahedral voids and also one more tetrahedral void is observed here. The similar arrangements we can observe at different positions in a HCP unit cell. Here, this, these two blue colored atoms are from two other unit cells, two other unit cells. This is from this unit cell. These three positions along with this corner make one tetrahedral void on this edge. Similarly, we can get one more at this position, at this position with these three atoms, with these three atoms and this corner. So this way on the edges, on the edges, each edge will carry two tetrahedral voids. Each edge will get two tetrahedral voids. So totally there are six edges, side edges, you can imagine side edges, six edges are there. The so number of edges together on six edges will be number of tetrahedral voids on six edges will be 12, but contribution of each of that edge towards each unit cell is one third, 12 into one by three, four. Each edge is shared by three unit cells. So the contribution will be one third by each tetrahedral void on the edge. And there are totally 12 tetrahedral voids on edges. So together, the effective number of tetrahedral voids from edges is four. And the remaining eight out of 12 tetrahedral voids are found within the body. You can locate them with this diagram. Look at this, these three atoms and this atom together make one tetrahedral void exactly on the line passing the line passing through these atoms like this. So this is one position. Similarly, we'll get one more here, one more here. Okay. So there are two like this and the other position. So this is if, if a line joining these atom, this, two, this atom and this atom is taken within the body. There are two tetrahedral voids are found on it and remaining six positions will be observed like this way. This is the other position of tetrahedral void. These three atoms and this atom make one tetrahedral void below this and one above this. This is the other position. This is the other position of tetrahedral void. Similarly, similarly, below and above each of these blue colored atoms, each of these blue colored atoms, we can finally get six tetrahedral voids one here, one here. Similarly, above this one, below this one, above this one, below this one. Totally six positions can be observed like that. So six at these positions, two at these positions, together makes eight tetrahedral whites within the body, eight tetrahedral whites within the body, and four tetrahedral whites on the edges together, 12, 12 tetrahedral whites are observed in a HCP unit cell. Thanks for watching.